Hey, what's going on, people? Bear Fox here, and welcome back to another brand new video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys the best screen recorder that you can utilize to record your gameplays as well as window screens. So, make sure to watch it till the end. I hope this video helps you out to make your decision. And with all that said, let's get started. Alright, so in this video, we're going to be talking about phone pause screen recorder. We have already covered this in our previous videos, but in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys some of the newer modes and some different specifications about this application that can help you to make your mind on getting the screen recorder. So first things first, you can go to the link in the description below and download phone pro screen recorder by just clicking on free downloading and downloading it for windows once you have downloaded and installed it you will see a simple interface just like this now i really love how simple the interface is because if you go and download some complex applications such as obs there are a lot of settings to change and you might get confused so if you're a beginner this application is really really beginner friendly and you can simply get your hands on to it really easily also this application offers you video recording audio recording, game recording, window, webcam, phone, and so much more. But in today's video, we're going to be talking about video, audio, and window recording. Firstly, if you select video recording, this is the custom area where you can record your screen. Now, it is really helpful if you want to record videos or something like that. But if you want to record your full screen, I recommend you guys to go with full and that will stretch out the boundaries just like that. And you can record complete screen in case you don't like it you can set a smaller region you can simply drag it to sides you can also drag it on your windows wherever you want by doing this so you can just record that part only but i would like to record full screen and you can add exclusions that is the best part so any other window that you might have opened and you don't want it to be a part of your recording you can exclude that window and that will help you to not capture that window so it is helpful while recording you can also select any other display that you have connected it is really convenient to select your display you can you know if you use multi displays you can add display one or two to the one that you want to record it also allows you to record your webcam so if you turn it on it will open up your webcam now i haven't connected mine yet but that is how it works you can simply drag it to make it smaller keep it on one side and you can simply use your webcam as it is it also helps you to record your system sound as well as your microphone which is really awesome and if you select your microphone there are two options to enhance your microphone's quality so it has inbuilt feature for cancellation of noise as well as microphone enhancements so let's say if your microphone is really dull it will help you optimize the audio and that will give you better sound output so as you guys can see i've selected my microphone and as i speak the level goes up so that is all about the video recorder it also helps some advanced recording options where you can simply record around your mouse so wherever you follow your mouse you can simply record that part and you can also click on follow the mouse so wherever the mouse goes it follows the recording just like that so that is how it works also you can add custom watermarks to your video so if you want a text watermark you can add it over here uh, you can simply click on manage and you can change the text anything so i'll just change this to bear fox simply click on apply and yeah it will add your watermark to the video i would also like to talk about a very amazing setting of this application that is the auto stop you can simply enable auto stop and auto stop helps you with a lot of these settings so first one is recording length so let's say if you want to record a 20 minutes gameplay you can simply click on the recording length and set this length to around 20 minutes and once you set it, it will automatically cut off the recording after 20 minutes. It also has another option that is file size. So let's say if your file size is around 10 GB, you do not have uh, a lot of storage and you are concerned about the storage. So your file size won't go above 10 GB and you can select for each time and each time I record the games. I will not record it over 10,000 MB and that is really helpful for storage management. And the last option is the ending time. So as you guys can see the time right now, I am recording over here. If I want the recording to end at 22.31, that is exactly one hour after this session. And after the recording is done, you can simply click on shutdown computer. You can use this while recording your online classes or sessions that you don't want to miss. So let's say your session is one hour long, so you can put this on recording and once the session is done, it will auto stop the recording as well as shut down itself and this is really amazing way you can utilize this setting 
And here are some screen recording samples. As you guys can see, using this application, I could record my gameplay completely fine. It was lossless and the quality is really amazing as well. I'd let you guys watch this gameplay for a while before we talk about some more amazing settings. I would also like to talk about the window recorder where you can select any specific window or process on your system and that will only record that part without any interruption or hindrance. So that is also really helpful. And another thing that I would like to talk about is the audio recorder. So let's say that you only want to record your intros or outros or anything related to that. You can simply select audio recording and you can select your microphone. I do not want my system sounds to be recorded whenever I am recording my audio so I just turn this thing off and the only thing that I want to record is my microphone so this is how I record my intros and my outros using this application I would also like to go through the best settings so you can simply open up the preferences and for recording I would recommend you guys to remove the show countdown before recording and that will start your recording instantly I would also recommend you guys to turn off show recording boundary so you don't see that annoying yellow line outside the boundary also enable beep on start recording so you know when you are recording and when you are stopping the recording also go all the way down and for the screenshot format I would recommend you guys to go with PNG but if you are worrying about the size you can go with JPG also for the video format go with MP4 and for Kodak you can go for H264 if you do not have a graphics card but if you are looking for the best quality images but if you're looking for the best quality gameplays, I would recommend you guys to go with HEVC and H265 that can record your gameplay in HDR. Also, I would recommend you guys to go for the video quality to lossless and frame rate to 60 FPS and keyframe interval should always be set to 2 seconds. Then for the audio settings, go with MP3, but sometimes you can go with WAV or M4A, both works the best. Audio quality should also be lossless, then scroll down and you have mouse and keystroke. Now how it helps is you can click on show mouse cursor so it records your mouse cursor and it also shows you mouse and keystrokes. So I would recommend you guys to enable this option as well. So if you're recording a tutorial, you will also record your mouse as well as the keystrokes. Also, here are some hotkeys so you can customize the application the way you like. Uh, you can bind your recording, stopping, opening and closing of windows with the shortcuts you're comfortable with. Also, if you scroll down to the more section, you have a screen capture mode and I would recommend you guys to keep it auto and hardware acceleration. Always turn it on. If you have a graphic card, this setting itself will help you a lot. If you are having a low end computer and you want to record your gameplays, this would be really really beneficial also make sure to select always run this as administrator so you do not have any issues while recording your games and once it is done simply click on ok and you are ready to use this application so guys phone pro screen recorder is really helpful for such cases and if you are a beginner or starting a youtube journey or any tutorial journey i would recommend you guys to get it without wasting any more time since it will be a game changer i hope this video helps you out if it does make sure to do leave a like and smash your subscribe button down below i hope i have helped you making a decision on which screen recorder you want to get and if that helped surely do leave your comments and we'll see you in another video until then stay tuned keep watching bear fox and peace out